Once upon a time, there lived a powerful snake girl named Linda. She had a human heart or the body of a serpent with scale that shimmered like the moonlight night. Linda also had a lovely husband named Felix. They often changed to human so that they could relate with them. Both of them loved each other so much. Most times, they got so bored in the bush alone. There were other snakes like them, but because of the past betrayer, they separated themselves from others. They found joy visiting the village. Up in the hills, they turned to humans, then visit the village. Linda and Felis made so many friends in the village, which make them visit the villagers regularly. The villagers do not know where Felis and his wife always come from, but they enjoy their presence with lovely stories. One day, tragedy strikes the village. A snake bites a worthy man's only son, and the child, which was not noticed on time, the son died. This made the man and some villagers angry, and they set out to kill all the snakes they found. A lot of snakes were killed, while some were injured. Unfortunately, Felix was affected because he was in a snake form. He managed to escape for his life and went straight to his wife. He changed to his human form and told his wife he was attacked by the villagers. Linda cried bitterly and tried treating her husband before he finally gave up. Unfortunately, she lost her husband, Felix. Linda's eyes became red, full of pains. She cried and buried her husband, Felix. She mourned her husband. In the aftermath of tragedy, Linda, consumed by grief, uttered a curse upon the village, vow vengeance for the harm inflicted upon her beloved husband, Felix. The villagers, unaware of the consequences, continued their lives oblivious to the impending repercussions of their actions. As the cause took hold, strange occurrences plunged the village, crops withered, and once fertile land turned barren. Unexplained shadows danced in the moonlight, sending shivers down the spines of those who dare to wander outside their homes. Linda, foiled by sorrow and hunger, embraced her serpent form, becoming a mysterious force in the village. Whispers of a vengeful snake spirit spread among the villagers, instilling fear and paranoia. In the midst of chaos, a wise Edda records Tales of appeasing ancient spirits. The villagers, desperate to leave the course, organize a gathering to seek guidance from a renowned mystic who lived on the askesh of the village. Little did they know that this mystic had the key to understanding Linda's grief and finding a path of reconciliation. The mystic Wise in the ways of ancient law, reveal the tragic tale of Linda and Felix. The villagers realize the consequences of their actions. We are torn between remorse and fear of the vengeful spirits they had provoked. A group of brave villagers set out to find Linda and seek her forgiveness. Deep in the heart of the woods, they discover the grieving snake girl, still mourning the loss of her beloved Felis. With sincere apologies and heartfelt remorse, 
the villagers begged Linda for forgiveness. Touched by their sincerity, Linda's eyes softened as she considered the possibility of breaking the curse that bound them all. United in their quest for redemption, Linda and the villagers embarked on a journey to uncover the ancient rituals and restore balance to the once peaceful village. Little did they know that their efforts would test their courage and resilience against mystical challenges that lay ahead. As Linda and the villagers dived into the ancient rituals, they encountered trials designed to test their resolve and sincerity. The mystical journey led them through a chanted forest where illusions play tricks on their minds and mysterious creatures tested their unity. Amidst these challenges, both funds between Linda and the villagers grew stronger. The once divided community found common ground, learning the value of compassion and understanding, guided by the mystic wisdom. They reached a sacred site where ancient symbols glue with otherworldly energy. Together, they perform a ritual to channel the village. Collective remorse and made the severed connection with the spirit world. In a moment of profound transformation, the cause began to lift. The withered crops flourished and the once barren land regained vitality. Linda now at peace felt fairly present in the gentle rustle of leaves and the whisper of the wind. As Harmony returned to the village, Linda, with gratitude in her heart, chose to stay among the villagers, bridging the gaps between their worlds. The once divided community emerged stronger, bound by a newfound respect for the delicate balance between humans and mystical spirits. In the aftermath of the ritual success, Linda and the villagers found themselves living in a renewed harmony. The once broken bonds between the human and mystical realms had been restored, and the village flourished with newfound prosperity. Linda, now a guardian spirit, continued to guide and protect the village. Her presence became a symbol of reconciliation reminding the villagers of the consequences of their actions and the power of unity. The tale of Linda and the villagers spread far and wide, becoming a cautionary story of empathy and understanding. Travelers passing through the region would hear of the snake girl who transformed tragedy into a lesson of forgiveness. As time passed, the village, tribe, and memory of the cause became a distant echo in the collective consciousness. Linda, once a creature of sorrow and vengeance, now stood as a testament to the transformative power of compassion and unity in the face of adversity. Thanks guys for watching this video, do not forget to subscribe to our channel to support us, like, share and do not forget to drop your comment below.